Okay, so uh, now we're going to look at the bowline. So the bowline is basically a non-slip loop. We decide on the size of the loop and then we tie the knot. So don't get the two mixed up. So um, set the size of your loop, which uh, start at one end with the short end in your right hand, if you're right-handed. And then what I would do when I'm tying a bowline, I just cross it over the standing end like so, make the knot, then I go around the back of the line and down the hole, pull the end and pull the standing end and you've got a bowline with the line inside the knot. So that's a bowline. But to make it a little bit easier, we can set the loop size again and then we can make the knot. So let's make the start of the knot there. Okay. So you can see how I have made the loop and the short end, which is going to come back to me, is on top. Now that's important. Okay, so as you can see, the short end coming back to me is on top. And if you get that bit right, the rest of the knot is easy. So my left hand is running down to what would be the long end. Obviously, I've only got a short bit of line here. Okay, so let's have a look at how we do this. So the short end in my right hand, I've made the loop already. I go up through the hole, so like a rabbit coming out of a hole. I go round the back of the line, so that's a tree, round the back of the tree, and then back down the hole again pull the rabbit down and pull and there we are and we've got the bowline non-slip loop right so we'll try that one more time so uh, as you can see it's not it's it's not slipping so um, one more time set the size of the loop you want it could be any size small or larger so set the size of the loop you want make your knot making sure that the line comes back from the top of the loop then you go up through the loop or through the knots rather round the back and down through the hole and pull tight and the tails inside the loop and you've got a non-slip loop and that's your bowline i hope you found this short video tutorial useful if you did please click the like button this helps promote the video on youtube if you've got any of your own tips or experience you'd like to share or you've got an idea for a video let me know in the comments section below and if you aren't already a subscriber consider subscribing and remember to click the little bell so you are notified when i release my next video there are various links that might interest you in the description section under this video until next time sell safe